Always a solid performer. Great mark taken by Stretch. Jason Dunster would have been proud of that. Pretty good kick of the football, Stretch. Actually, he could kick this, Peter. It's not beyond him. So let's see what the South Australian can do. From outside 50, low trajectory kick. Probably won't quite make the distance. Better! Oh, Jakovic it is. Tremendous grab right in the square. And he's only played four games. Jakovic, but look at this mark. And here it is. We just see Jakovic getting the ride there and coming up from behind. A great mark. So from point blank range, he'll get Melbourne's third goal. So Lyons, Spalding, and now Jakovic. The goal kickers for the Demons. 3 2 to 1 2 at the SCG. Well, he could have kicked eight last week, the man on screen. He only finished with three goals, but he had five points. He was one of Melbourne's better players. They didn't have too many good players last week. This is his fourth game of AFL football. A little at sea in his first couple. Bays at the back. Stretch does better. Long hand pass. Jay Videy just off the centre circle. Kicks down to Bennett and Jakovic territory. Mark missed by Thrip. Jakovic. Boot to ball with the right foot this time. Oh, he's and he's it. put it through. Dyson is having a wild kick. Now it's stretched, stretched to the half forward line. That's a good mark. Taken there by David Flintoff, former Hawthorne player. Good kick too to Bryce. Now Dyson, the short pass is on. Jakovic, no mark. He led well, he's got it. Swings onto the right foot. Sprints into goal and slams it through for a great goal. Jakovic has kicked his third. And Melbourne doing it on the bit. 9.13 to 4.6. Well, there's a little bit of class the way he went about doing that. Normally he swings onto the left foot. That sign he decided to go the other way. This was a good build up by Melbourne. Firstly, well, Bryce going down, getting it across to Dyson. It's a good pass by Dyson. He seems to kick equally well with both feet, Don, doesn't he? My word, well, he is normally a right foot kick, but he showed a lot of toe when he started that corner manoeuvre. Sudden, the margin is only 28 points. So they're in with a chance. Cuthbertson to the forward line. Oh, Mark to Jakovic. Don't know about Kelly playing on Jakovic. We said that a moment ago. It's only a little fella, uh, Kelly. They're just about exhausted as far as options go, aren't they, Peter, yeah. really? I thought you'd have to have a bigger guy. Jakovic is pretty strong. Look at the build of him. Well, they've got Thrip on the wing or half back. He had him earlier. Mm. Well, I suppose they, forward, they had to do something, didn't they? Well, Djokovic has kicked three. Now he's directly in front. Alan Djokovic, he might have kicked a goal here, I think. Yes, he has. So that's his fourth. He's been an exciting player up there on the forward line. Plenty of skill. 11-17, Melbourne, Sydney. They remain on 7-7. Well, he has kicked five, uh, seven points. And there he is. Putting through his fourth. Well, it's not a bad effort, is it? 11 shots at goal. Murphy. Got a chance for Todd Vardy again inside the square. He'll be looking for Bennett or Djakovic. Oh, Djakovic is going to get this one. And buries it. Five to Djakovic. So two goals coming up in 20 seconds, three and a half minutes before three-quarter time, 42 points the difference. Well, that typically sums up today's game, doesn't it? A clean bowl, everybody. Sydney just, there's no luck or no, nothing going their way. It's going all Melbourne's. Look at this one. A clean bowls, everybody. Look, through everybody. And who's behind? By himself, Djakovic. An easy goal. Well, that's not luck. That's good play. What, standing behind? That is good play. It was poor play by the Swans' defence, and that's talent when you can do that. What oh. Bennett and he did. Stephen Tingate, straight up in the air. Nettlebeck, threw a little bit too early. Obbs, beautifully done. Spalding, Dyson. Jay Viney, back it comes to Jay Viney now. Where's the lead? There it is. And uh, making space for himself was Jakovic. Beautiful lead, great pass, and he'll line up for goal number six. Well, there's just so many options going on that Page just didn't know where to go left, right, or up the centre, and uh, there was really no pressure, as we saw there, the break from the midfield. 
And when you're a forward, you're able to lead confidently, knowing the ball will be delivered in the right way. Alan Jakovic for goal number six, puts it right through. Hot Viney at left half forward flank, still wearing the scars of the CUB side. Flint off. Cuthbertson, centering kick. Plenty of options down there. Yates, he might take another one. Now the umpire didn't play the mark. Dyson and Nettlebeck. Oh. And Bryce, oh, not at a, comes back to Djakovic. And Djakovic will kick a goal on his left foot. Dyson oh. was standing in the goals where he could have hand passed it over the top. Well, two Melbourne players have kicked 14 goals between them. Bennett, seven, and Djakovic, seven. Tui up near the centre of the ground. Oh, Carroll's dropped the sitter on the chest. Now he kicks from 60 and kicks into the man. Oh, they're doing as they like. Here's Flintoff. Tingay. Now, what's going to happen this time? There's a beautiful lead, Djakovic. Look, he read that. They haven't got much idea, the Swans, today. Thanks. Much, I would say no idea. This is Djakovic just doing that as easy as he liked. He took that mark. Look at this. It's too easy. But he has got a lot of talent. I like this player. He's a real good football brain. Look at the kick. Drifting slightly, but sneaks it in for his eighth goal. Beautiful kick. So, what a performance by the two forwards. Eight to Djakovic, seven to Bennett. And Melbourne just careering away with this game. They've taken their score on to 21-18 to 7-8. Well, this effort by Djakovic is the best effort, equal to that of Darren Bennett this year. Bennett had kicked eight goals. That was against Fitzroy in round two. Cuthbert's going to kick seven on two occasions. So that effort of eight goals by Djakovic, equal to any Melbourne player this year. Coming off the ground is Djakovic, and down there with him is Cameron. Alan, tremendous effort. Eight goals from you. That equals Darren Bennett's uh, best performance by a Melbourne player this year. Must be pretty happy. Yeah, I'm happy that we won, first of all. And, uh, we uh, defeated that hoodoo. You know, we're going to go on from now, and it's a good feeling. Yeah. It's a great feeling also to break uh, that run of darks five in a row. Yeah, well, that's what I mean. You know, it's, uh, we're going to move on from here and go, go from bigger to better things now. Yeah, thanks. Alan Djakovic, we're pretty pleased with his effort.